Hello, this is Michelle Knight, and here's your weekly astrology for the week starting the 24th of April. And it's not a bad little week. We have Venus, the planet of love, shifting signs, and a lovely little trine. Having said that, of course, we still have Pluto retrograde and Mercury retrograde. Here's your weekly astrology. Hey lovely Taurus, welcome to an exciting week. This week you have the opportunity to get your power back in some way. It may be that you felt that somebody had power over you. It could be someone you felt you had a really spiritual or emotional or sexual connection with and it overwhelmed you. You kind of gave a bit of yourself away. This week you're able to get that back. There may still be a lack of boundaries with that person or situation. Um, but you're on the right track. And that's because Mercury, the planet of communication, although it's retrograde, making you think about past lives, etc., etc., it's trining Papa, stubborn, single minded Saturn in your eighth house of power and kind of primal emotions. And this is about you feeling more secure in yourself, feeling that you can get your power back when it comes to your finances, feeling that you can express yourself in a powerful way. Okay, you know, as I said, beware, Mercury's retrograde. It's a time really to ponder and to think about things and lay some plans for your future. On top of that, on the 26th, we have a new moon. Oh yeah, it's in your sign. This is great. It's your very own birthday moon. It's a time where you express your ability to let go. So normally it's very difficult for if you're a typical Taurus to let go of things. Once you love, you love forever. If you've got friends, you keep them forever. You, you've got your routines and, and you love them. But New Moon gives you the opportunity to surrender what no longer serves you. It's also the perfect time to cast out your dreams to the universe and make a wish. And as it's sextile Neptune, a very magical Um, energy is around it and it's making you particularly lucky on that day when it comes to groups of people something extraordinary could happen if you socialize or possibly even in connection with social media but bear in mind anything to do with social media at the moment be careful what you put out there because it will remain forever into all eternity so make sure it's a kind or an honest or a true representation of yourself and your soul Venus is shifting signs and she's going into this very psychic space. Fortunately for us, she's going direct. So you may find yourself meeting someone or engaging or even remembering if you're in a relationship, a past life connection with someone or being super psychic when it comes to your loved one or meeting someone and you feel like it's fated, you, you feel like you've known them forever and that there's this really immediate bond. So that's very, very exciting. Although, be warned, Venus in that position can lack boundaries. It can make you kiss someone inappropriate. Well, not make you, but, it can, you know, you, you feel like so connected that you can do something that maybe you wouldn't normally do. So all in all, this week is supremely exciting and has a lot of potential for you. Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon. so much for watching please like and share if you do and i've got a little present for you if you go to horoscope.co.uk i now have not only a free chart wheel but free birth chart interpretation so pop along and have a look take care and i'll speak to you soon